All right, so I am here with uh, SMCA senior forward Lewis Couch. Uh, we just watched an outstanding missile uh, championship game, and tonight Lewis found out that he was recognized as first team all league. Lou, tell me a little bit about your, your thoughts and your feelings when you found out you were first team all league. Uh, it was definitely something special. Um, throughout high school, I never really got recognized for like any of the things that I did during the season, especially not first team, no honorable mention, like anything like that. So definitely hearing my name first team after all the stuff that I've been through, it was definitely special. Definitely, definitely. So, man, I, I'm, I'm a little biased. I had a chance to coach <laughs> you this year, so I know you inside out. But I want to ask you about this season, man. What are some of the things, some of the takeaways, things that you learned this season, not only playing for SMCA, but competing throughout the league? The league is definitely tough because we have a, a pretty much a young team and going against guys that are either bigger, stronger, or more experienced than us. Tacoma has a bunch of seniors and then Lanham has a bunch of strong guys and big guys. So it's definitely uh, a little bit different facing the adversity and stuff like that. We have a pretty strong group ourselves. We just needed to compete more and more. It was just the ups and downs during the season, how we got through them. So I'm really proud of my guys, how they stepped up during the season, how they must have grown too. No doubt, no doubt. So memories you know this was your final ride in high school yes, sir. definitely uh gonna be playing beyond high school if i had to bet my mortgage that was gonna happen <laughs> that's gonna happen yes, sir. but but let me ask you what are some memories that you just kind of want to take away and reflect on as you get ready to transition from the high school season into the travel season definitely showing out at the tournaments that we went to allowing me to showcase my talents to other people and other people that haven't seen my talents definitely like the hotel memories too with my team just bonding and team dinners with reverend jackson that our team dinners he would bless us bless the food and then have a little testimony, a little ceremony. I mean, just like overall little small things of the season, getting to know my coaches. Uh, Coach Ted was a new addition to the group. I um, got, got to know him pretty well. I'm pretty tight with him, too. So, I mean, this is good for us. I went from Centerville to North Carolina back up to Maryland. So, it was definitely a change of scenery. I had to adjust it pretty well. But, I mean, I had a bunch of people in my corner to get me through that, uh, get me through the tough times. So, yeah. So, along those lines, Southern Maryland Christian Academy. Yes, sir. Um, definitely a different place, a special place. Just, just talk a little bit about what SMCA means to you, you know, spending your senior year at SMCA. Um, there are definitely a lot of good mentors, not even just on basketball, but the teaching staff in general. I got a lot of great teachers like Mr. Namus, Ms. Crawford, who's the uh, dean, of, uh, dean of academics over there. She helped me out uh, huge because I'm taking also high school classes and also college classes. So she helped me out with managing my time and stuff like that, uh, along with athletics. And then I also have uh, great teachers along with Mr. Jackson, my Bible teacher. We have a lot of good talks and then just like the atmosphere like with the students and stuff, like all the younger students looked at the upperclassmen as like big brothers and sisters. So it was kind of cool walking around the walking around the school, everybody knowing who I am and just uh, looking up to me and stuff like that. No, you did a great job with leadership, man. You had um, uh, definitely big shoes to follow, and you you didn't disappoint at all. My last uh, question or thought for you tonight is, who would you like to thank, man, as you look back? Who are some of the, the people in your circle, man, that you just want to give a shout out to? Uh, shout out to my mom and my dad for staying the course and believing in me this whole way. Uh, Coach McGlone and Coach Washington, the coaching staff at SMCA, Coach Jimmy, Coach Butch, and Coach Ted. Uh, Coach Ted for helping me get my shot better. Coach Butch for just keeping me in my corner, keeping me sane. Coach Jimmy for just telling me what to keep doing, what I'm doing. Uh, Coach, uh, Coach McGlone, thank you for opening your home to me. I really appreciate that because without you, I wouldn't even be here. Uh, Coach Chummy, thank you for pushing colleges towards me as well. And um, Coach Lou on Team Biss, uh, throughout the summer, he get me, got me to the point for my skill set to be at the point where I can get first team this year. So I can't thank him enough for taking the time and taking the sacrifice for me. Also, Coach Liggins and Coach Dan as well on Team Best. And then um, just shout out to my, uh, my cousin Kobe. Um, he's been in my ear the whole time, making sure I'm, my head's on straight and stuff like that. And my teammates at GBB, Jalik and uh, Kaden and CJ, those guys, and Isaiah, those guys really like, even though we departed ways in North Carolina, we stayed in each other's corners and just made sure we were doing the right thing. So I just want to shout out to everybody that was in my inner circle and stuff like that. And uh, I really wouldn't be here without them, so I appreciate y'all. All right, well, man, the future looks bright, man. Keep us posted what's going on. Yes, sir. And, um, uh, again, congratulations on first team all league. Thank you, Coach. And I'm looking forward to the uh, round ball classic coming yes, up sir. as yes, well sir. in Hagerstown. Yes, sir. All right. All right. Now. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm.